Robin uh, challenges me when I say Insane Clown Posse are uh, international superstars, but they are. They are very, very wealthy young men. They have built an empire. Well, there are plenty of wealthy people who aren't superstars. They have sold tons of records. Yeah, I'll let the boys tons. inform you. Tons. <laughs> uh, you know Insane Clown Posse made $10 million last year? Look at the boys. They look great. They look hello, great. Hello, hello, hello. They've never hello. changed their look. Not at all. They stay Still true to that look. Still in the makeup. Still in the makeup. You know, a lot of people thought the makeup was a gimmick when you boys started. And uh, that makeup is not a gimmick. Well, it's, that's, it's actually just our face. And it's like, you know, the joke in the first Batman, we got to put flesh tone paint over this to go out normally. You know what I'm saying? You I look, don't know why you wouldn't have it tattooed on it this Right, point. right. Yeah, you know? <laughs> you can't walk around like that 24 <laughs> It works great at the airport. They love us there. Boys, great to see you. I you was, too, man. You know, I love that. Uh, I like the video, Miracles. You took a lot of shit for that video. We sure did. And, and we we're serious about it. I want everybody to know that. That wasn't supposed to be funny. That was coming from the heart. The video I'm talking about, of course, everyone has seen it. Uh, <laughs> miracles. What are you laughing for? Yeah, I want what's so funny. So you see that? Ah, <laughs> what is so funny about that? I, I'm, I'm going to go along with this for what? now. Go along with it. These oh. guys everyone put out a video. Seen it. It's quite a controversy. First of all, I think it's a very expensive video. It looked very rich. You guys are flying through space. Yeah, that was really space, too, man. <laughs> you guys actually went up in space. They actually yeah. went to space. Yeah, that shit went cheap. But, boys, you talk about in that uh, song, the miracle of life, the beauty that you see around you. You even describe in the song, which is my favorite passage, about how you went to feed a, uh, a, a pelican a fish. Yes. And it ate your cell phone. <laughs> it and to me, did, yeah. what it, it doesn't that say it all? Really? Well, we're from Detroit. We don't have pelicans running around. <laughs> right. You know what I mean? To yeah. sit, stand there in San Francisco and see a pelican, you know, about trip. five feet away from you, and then actually think your cell phone is a fish and try to eat it. That <laughs> trips out, trips you out. If you're from Detroit, we don't have pelicans with giant beaks and all that. Your fans understand that, but someone like Robin doesn't understand. <laughs> it's unfortunate because it's beautiful. Right. Uh, I'm. I'm. Are they growing up? I mean, you're. you're <laughs> Indicating that they have emotions I've never heard Boys, described to them or described to them Are you getting, before. for lack of a better word, softer in know, your see, old age? No, that, that's, absolutely not. Go ahead, man. Go ahead. That, 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 you, you have to understand, that's nothing new to, to, to the juggalos have heard us sing songs like that. I mean, you could put CDs together, full compilations, if you took all the songs we've done like that in the past. If it you have, the beginning. You, you have done sensitive music before. Deep. You know, in deep fact, songs. People would be surprised about you guys that they think you're just a bunch of violent thugs. But you, like, like you're against. Uh, you don't like Ted Nugent, for example, because he's into hunting. You don't like hunting, right? Well, you know, he's people like him for his musician musicianship. Why does he constantly talk about hunting? He even brings out a bow and arrow on stage. It's, it's like, like, who gives it? If, if you're not into hunting, you know what I mean? I mean, if you're not into hunting and you're into his music and you're sitting there watching him hunt on stage and shit, it's like. Relax with the hunting, man. You right, know? right. Like people, guitar, so. That's not what got him famous. But in Miracles, you guys, you put together a beautiful-looking video, and you say, listen, the world, you look at the world like an innocent child. Look at the beauty See, in the world. I get it. your music, man. I know where you're at. You know, and, and then... Recently having kids myself, a couple you years ago, few years ago. You had kids? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. I've been on here for a minute, huh? And they're, and they're geniuses, too. But, you know, watching everything through their eyes again is uh, pure awesomeness. You know right. what I'm saying? Like yeah. a ladybug or a caterpillar, you know what I mean? Right, you seeing rediscover that, the world. Yeah, yeah, and seeing what it means again, you know, and, and you get lost in the everyday shuffle of life, and then you can't express yourself right because people people are so judgmental now, and especially today's age where everybody lives on the Internet and nobody even leaves out of their house anymore to experience real shit, you know? Nature, yeah. Your fans, right. they, some of them did not understand our miracles. fans, yeah. I, I didn't hear anything bad from from the from the Juggalo so Nation. You really? feel it was your critics who came down on you for this, as time. usual, right? Right. Well, you probably know, really ain't our critics who are just critics in general. You know, <laughs> Robin doesn't understand. What we just discussed before was usually critics of music are failed musicians themselves. That's you know true. What I'm saying? Uh, Robin doesn't understand the power of you guys. I mean, uh, I really have not had any experience of this Juggalo Nation. Do you want to know what? Do you want to know what though? What? Hey. Jay is a, a recently single guy. 
To Robin? Well, What's he just up? had a kid. What, what happened no, to that woman? Yes, he's not old. He dumped his wife. <laughs> we ain't been here in a few years, man. Violent J, you dumped your wife uh, really? shortly after she had the kid. What happened? Did you get turned <laughs> off to her pregnancy? Sure. What the what, fuck happened? Elvis? There? What's going on? Yeah, what are no, you, Elvis? No, we were together for a long time, you know what I mean? It's just that it wasn't working out on that level. You what know happened? What I mean? You're an attractive man. I imagine she uh, loved you. Uh, was it the road uh, <laughs> temptation? Did you get turned off to her? No, man. I, you know, it just wasn't. I, I didn't couldn't find, fuck her anymore. I found it impossible to make her happy anymore. You know what I mean? Is that true? You mean you were in love with her, but she was never happy? Yeah. Why is that? What do you think went wrong? I think that. Uh, I think that. Uh, you know, I met her when she, she was woke young. Up? No. You know yeah. what I'm saying? How young was she? <laughs> she? She woke up. She was. She was 19 when I met her. No it kidding. Was eight years ago, though. I see. You know, and I just think that. Uh, you know, but the bottom line is, I'm I'm a I'm a I consider myself one of the hottest free agents in the game right now. Are you a player? Yeah, absolutely. You are. Absolutely. You're out there fucking like a rabbit. Right now. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I got a lot of built up aggression. You know what I'm saying? But <laughs> you have to understand, like you know, uh, I was good. I was. You ever fuck a girl with the clown makeup on? So many times, brother. Uh, did you ever fuck your wife with the clown makeup on? No. Ah. Uh, yeah. Early on. Come maybe on. early. Maybe early. On. It wasn't like I, I was at home and I put it on before I fucked her. Do chicks dig that? I mean, when you have the makeup well, on. Well, sometimes it's a convenience thing. You know what I'm saying? You're right. backstage. You're in the bus. See, you're about he pulls to up show. stuff I can't be doing. You know, I, c I could never do that. You know what I'm saying? Don't like, your wife with oh, the you never fuck your wife. Oh, you never fuck nobody. No, no, no. I'm saying like you know what I'm saying like a backstage situation. You know, it's so dirty and nasty. You know what I'm saying? It's <laughs> yeah. like oh, I can't. It just, <laughs> See, people think of you as a guy who would just fuck anywhere. And I mean, you're a class I, I, guy. I could in a lot of places, just not like, in, you know, whatever. Backstage. Like backstage, that's sick, man. You know how much nuts on that couch and, like, how much <laughs> ass juice and balls <laughs> been dragged off of that? You know what I'm saying? How yeah. horrible is that, man? Yeah, so, uh, if, uh, violent shit, that is disgusting, right? To be oh, backstage and fuck on, a girl. No, I mean, that. that's just, that's just me being a jerk freak. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I've been saying that I, I, I don't make a practice of it. But you fuck girls with the clown makeup on. One time in my life. It was That's the worst it. experience of my life. Why? Why was it bad? Because the broad wouldn't stop staring at my face. <laughs> Swear, I'm not going to lie to you, dog. Check yeah. it out. I'm hitting her right just normal, yeah. and she's just staring at my face. You know what I'm saying? Just staring at my face. I get it. Not even making a noise. Nothing. I, I, I'm, you know, I'll turn a bitch out. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> right. And she's just staring at my face. Oh, wow. I'm like, all right, cool. Let me try flipping this broad over. You know what I'm saying? So I flip her over. And she starts staring at my face again. You know, like an owl turning his head. I try to put my leg head, arm before him against the back of her neck. And somehow just turns around and looks at my face. I quit. Shaggy, I was like, you know, I'm done. I'm out of here. Shaggy, you married now? No. no. Well, I, 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 legally I am, but no. Right. <laughs> so you're both single. <laughs> No, I'm what not happened, single, what happened with I'm, your marriage? I'm really not. What I, happened with your marriage? It just dissolved. Right. You know, what happened? You know, kind of probably the same thing that happened to years, you know what I'm saying? Just long hours of work, just connection wasn't there. Little, right. You know, my, my former alcohol problem had a little something to do with it. You know what I'm saying? A lot sure. of shit. You know, you've been like, sober? You've been staying yeah, clean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No okay. doubt. Violent and, uh, J, you're not sober, are you? Huh? What? <laughs> <laughs> what is this? Are you boys still close off? Uh, you know, are, are, are you, or do you have to stay like away the, from him? Are you guys oh, like the Beatles? After sure, a while, man. they could they didn't really hang out. I see this guy every day, man. Every, every day, day of my life. so blessed in that fashion. Every day of my life. Every day, we talk constantly because you guys time. get a kick out of each other. Of course, and we're the only ones that truly, fully, truly understand each other. Right. Thank God we don't have to go through what we go through alone. Yeah, we right. have each other, you know. And it's you cool. Could... It's not like you know, like fifteen of us in a band. You know what I'm saying? We got fallouts happening right. everywhere. It's, it's more like a brothership than it is. Are you, you know? sick and tired of the industry not giving you any respect? Man, you guys made ten. I, what did you make? Ten million we're last so year? So done giving a shit. You don't give <laughs> you know a shit. What I'm saying? You don't care. No, we're if just doing we, our thing, man. If we were respected and loved like that, we wouldn't be what we are. We wouldn't be the most hated band in the world. But don't you think you should be on the Grammys? Seriously, wouldn't you like some sort of acceptance? Seriously. Seriously, come on. I would like, I don't give a fuck about a Grammy. This honest. Right. I would like to be invited. You know what I'm saying? I right. think we should be able to be recognized to be able to go. Not invited as like a, a nominee, but just to be able just to Just to be go. in the audience. Right. Yeah. Like, you, I, want, you know, I don't know you why. You know, it's kind of crazy. You know what I'm saying? What is it, two weeks ago, 
in, in Detroit, they did like the big Detroit Music Awards, and they gave us the uh, the Distinguished uh, Lifetime Music Award. In really? Detroit, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So you know what I'm saying? Is that true? It's, it's yeah, a sure. huge honor for us. I mean, they they have the video screen show. You don't believe it, Robin? <laughs> I want to see the award. Oh, <laughs> it's devastating. I'm like that, I'm like that with the uh, president. I need to see some. You're uh, like a birther. You want to see? Where it. Robin used to like us. This <laughs> is Hayden today, man. What's going on over she here? She doesn't believe that you guys are big stars. Meanwhile, I'm going to tell you this. I bet you there's a lot of record companies out there. You should go out this guy for one night, I'm telling you. You're single, right? Why are you, you trying to hook me up with Robin? Why not? You, 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 I mean, I'm with it. Here, right? Why don't you get with her? Oh, my God. Say, you're single, right? Because she ain't having it. I mean, I, I, I Would you go you. out with Violent J? In the makeup? No. He's clean. Would you, you wouldn't take her out in your makeup. Either or. You don't care. Would you go out with Violent J? I don't think so. Oh, Why? Because he's overweight? No. Oh, that has That's nothing muscle. to do with it. Absolutely pure. What's going on with your weight? I'm worried about you. Oh, here we go. go. What's going on, man? <laughs> Seriously. Man, I represent... Fat kid love, man. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? What I used you to worry now? about it. I used to. I don't really know. Probably, probably. I don't. I really don't even know. But honestly, what are you eating? That you're eating good food, or are you? Eating... I'm eating hella bad snacks at night. <laughs> <laughs> what do you like to eat? What happened? Double cheesy cheeseburgers, right? And pizza. And I love to, you know, eat good tasting food. I'll admit it. But uh, you know, honestly, I'm content with that. I mean, I'm, I'm honest with you. I'll be honest with you about everything. Right. I'm content with who I am. I love, I love who I am right now these days. Do you think I it do. turns your wife off, though? Because sometimes if you get very heavy, a woman just can't fucking it's stand possible, it. It's possible. It's possible. You know, my, yeah. my, my ex-girl was, like, extremely beautiful. You Were know you in I mean? love with her? Yeah. So did it hurt, break your heart when she said, that's it, it's over? She didn't. It, we just mutually, you know, we still raise the kids together, though. We're good right. friends. But did the saying? clown cry? Come on. There's, I've, a, there's I've a man cried behind the. Times. You have yeah. cried. I got a big heart. You do. Yeah. That's what I know about you guys. That you do have big hearts. Come on, I'd be front uh, if I said uh, I, mean, I don't <laughs> cry. <you know? laughs> right, right. So what Robin and the rest of the industry doesn't understand. <laughs> I no, bet what I really need to know is what is their business. Their business is music. What are you talking Man, about? Man, we dabble in so much shit. It's ridiculous. See, Tell you them. Don't you know what I'm saying? That's crazy do? shit. Really? What do you do? Crazy what shit. What do we do? Let's see. You know, we uh, we we run a record company, underground music. You know, an alternative to what's out there right. in the world. You know, right. an Street alternative to the mainstream. You're you know? doing what everyone talks about doing. They right. all say, "Oh, this should be an alternative." You're trying to keep that going. And, and you know, outside view, looking at what we do, most of the artists on our label have face paint of some sort. Really? Into an, yeah, into an outside view, it looks like it's all the same. But to the Juggalo Nation. It's so much more than that. It's so much more special than that. It's that every artist on our label has a character, a persona, a, a bio of interest. You know what I mean? How do you find an artist for your label? Do you do you get tapes submitted? If yeah, I want to be come on, man, it's it, we we it's a very small roster. You know what I'm saying? It's built right. over many years. You know, and then every once in a while, like our most recently signees are, are called the Dayton family. And they're like some some cast from back in the day that we love from Flint, Michigan. You know what I'm saying? Can you turn that these bitches out and make some coin with them? 